and now you can see the changes how it is looks like the application looks like okay so just say sign out hoping that everyone is following right or any questions or any doubts guys so far Venkat, Sonu, Srivad, Ram, Nilaitra, Mahender. Yeah. Api, Upadhyaya, Arya, Ajay. Everyone is clear? So yes. far, so clear? Yeah. Okay. Yes, sir. So far, so clear. So the first word, what we created here? Whatever uh, exercise which you are doing in a session, please follow that. So that it will be easy day and day. Try to do that in case if you are working, spend time on weekends. Okay. So that that would be the best practice. See now, this is our user. As I said, right, some defaults is going to come after all. come to assigning the employee role. Yes, you can see all the defaults here. Come to the navigator. I can see a lot many are available here. See here. Some seeded, whatever defaults which are going to available. Some here receivables which is available as a default. Without assigning the role, I can able to perform receivables. No, I need to assign the role. This is some seed at which I can able to see. And same way here, come to tools. Security console is coming. Why this is appearing with this user now? What is the reason? Because we have assigned IT security manager. Earlier, it was not showing because of we have not done the role assignment. Now see, setup and maintenance. Why this is appearing here? What roles it's going to be played to get this access, setup and maintenance? Who's not setup manager? Application implementation, Application implementation. implementation consultant. Okay. This is how you need to assign the roles and you need to verify the functionalities. Okay. Well. Okay. And <clears throat> one more important area. Of course, this can be applicable or Good to know for EBS consultants who are already working. When it coming to EBS, we need to complete your responsibility definition and we need to assign the responsibility to user and you need to perform GL activities from the GL responsibility, AP responsibility and all. But when it coming to cloud, there is no concept like that. Everything can be performed from the common platform. Okay, just go ahead and select your financial modules under which, for example, if you wanted to search any activity, for example, manage account calendar. This is something related to your general ledger, correct? General ledger activity. Accounting. And you need to be very, you know, clear on the spellings here, okay? If I update something incorrect, system won't pitch, okay? Manage accounting calendar. This is a task which I search with that. I can able to see the manage accounting calendar. From here, I can able to create the calendars. Okay. So, but when it coming to EBS, we need to go to general ledger super user or general ledger responsibility. From where you can able to uh, do that. But here in cloud, you can able to perform all the activities irrespective of module from one area. That is, you can call it as a common platform that is functional setup manager. Okay. Or else if you wanted to define any uh, uh, manage payment terms, let's example. Okay. Manage payment terms is part of your subledger, accounts payable, right? Subledger. So Department. here, man, for example, let's take manage invoice options or else manage common options. Okay. You can search from here. Okay. Select and of course, we are going to discuss in detail when we are, we are going to define just time showcasing some examples to compare with EBS, okay? See here, you can do this, okay? So means here, this would be the common platform where you can go ahead and perform all the configuration one area, rather going to respective responsibility level and all. This, you can call it as a functional setup manager. All the functional, the name itself indicating all functional related setups you can perform from here well so this task we are able to see because we have assigned the functional setup manager to the user correct no see this is here this is appearing because of you have completed assignment of 
your application implementation console. And for that reason, you can able to see. Once you click on this, you can able to see this particular area. From here, you can do whatever the configuration which you can. Yeah, yeah. Why this but, finance? But which, which, yeah, yeah. But which, which role, you know, it's an implementation consultant role? Yes, implementation consultant role, correct. Okay. IT security okay. manager role is to give For access to your security console. console, okay? And other defaults which are appearing because of you've done the employee. Employee assignment. Okay. okay. Well. Okay. So. So personal setup manager is just a navigation, not a role actually. Correct. Yes, it's a navigation. Correct. This is setup and maintenance equivalent to your functional uh, setup manager. You can call it. This setup okay. maintenance okay. equivalent to your functional setup manager. Okay. 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 I was just a little bit confused on that point. Yeah. No problem. So that's what I'm saying. Maybe initial days, maybe it, it would be a bit confused once you start doing a practice once you habituate it's very easy for you to understand okay setup and maintenance equivalent to your application you know uh, the functional setup manager you can call it okay why this is coming because of we have done the application implementation consultant okay if i wanted to search respective activity all the financial you can search it or else i wanted to go ahead and look okay i'm not sure with the task name okay you can call it as a task name whatever the activity okay here you can see some defined required task. If you wanted to do any configuration related to your fables, these are all the mandate configuration. Whatever you choose seen here under required task, these are all the mandatory configuration which supposed to do for your accounts payable. Until unless if you don't complete this, you cannot able to move on. Okay. And when it's coming to like you know, fixed assets. Here, these are all some mandatory configuration. Or else, if you wanted to see all the tasks, just say all tasks. All tasks. All tasks. You can able to see all payables related. All. For example, if I am not sure on the task name, just assume that. For example, even I don't know the task name for how to do the invoice options, or else how to search with the common options for payable procurement. You can come here and you can able to see it. Okay. All the tasks which can be available here. All the time. One question. Please. Oh, sorry, it may be a little bit early. So manage common options for financial uh, payables and procurement. So that is the same as a financial option in EBS, correct? That got changed because earlier financial option is for payables and procurement both. So that function may be changed, correct? Correct, correct. That uh, yes, I, I will uh, demonstrate in in detail when we start with okay. the accounts payable. Okay. Oh. Uh, because see now I, how I am explaining comparison with EBS and cloud. Same way we are gonna discuss wherever the changes and the mandatory things to be discussed. We are gonna discuss such a way. Okay. Right. Oh, okay. Right. Okay. Yeah. And so, sir, in the role, uh, yeah. uh, question from the role point of view only. Mm -hmm. So what happened in EBS? You know, if you remember, uh, we are assigning operating unit ledger in the system administrator. You know, MO security profile. So that uh, uh, and giving the operating unit access and all. So how that access is we need to give that you are explaining now or later point in time. That can be there is another concept called as a dash that is data access set. Okay, so that whenever we are gonna talk about the module level configuration, once the roles okay. are assigned, that also one of the important area to do that. Okay. So okay. we'll discuss about that. Okay. okay. So just that we'll yeah. discuss later. No? Yes, yes. Everything we're gonna discuss. Okay. okay. See, for example, some generic roles which basically it's not required any uh, data access set. Okay. Some respective mm -hmm. uh, module level those are required for the data access set. Okay. How to provide the okay. data access set and all we are gonna discuss until unless if I don't provide data access set, even I cannot able to move on. Okay. We'll discuss that. Okay, just, okay, just, okay. Yeah. I got it. So earlier the data access set only pertained to EBS GL module only, but now this is uh, common app and across all the, all, the all the applications for all the modules and all the roles okay. also. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Got it. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. No problem. No problem. So this is how you can able to see all the tasks. Okay. Either if you wanted to search financials, yes, you can search it. Or else, if I wanted to search particular, just assume that. Manage payment comes just such with that. I can able to see here. Manage payable calendars, all are part of your payables. Okay. Either of the ways you can search it. Either of the ways you can directly go ahead and search with your financials so that all will be patched. If you see here, general ledger, 
payables, payments, cash management, transaction tax, expenses, fixed assets, receivables, all are part of your financial elements I can able to see here. This you can call it as a functional setup search area, you can call it. There is another way of doing that, that is global search, okay? Both the ways you can search it. Either you can search it from here, either you can search it from global search. How to do that? Let me come again, come to your user, setup and maintenance. This page will be open, same page. From here, come here and just say, search it here. You can search it irrespective of anything. For example, uh, earlier case, let's, let's see here. Here, for example, manage enterprise. Just search, just search with that. Manage enterprise, SCM information. Okay, this is something which is part of financials. It's a, they have in, introduced here enterprise profile. Okay, in case something which is not available here, you can come here. Okay, or else let's search with manage procurement agent. Yeah, see here, this is also you can able to search few of the task, okay, which cannot be available from here, you can able to search from here, okay. Either see whatever which is available here, it does not mean that you cannot able to search from here, no. Either of the ways you can able to search, okay. Let's let's go ahead and search with that. For example, manage uh, common options. Let's search with that, manage common options. See here, manage common options for payable procurement. From here also, you can able to search it. From there also, you can able to search it. This would, for example, if you wanted to search anything related to human capital or supply chain management and all, you can search from here, from the global search. Or else, if you wanted to search from the this respective area, functional setup area, you can able to search it. The main difference you need to understand here is, here, financial only, you can able to search. In case if you wanted to search anything related to your other than financial offering, you can come here and search. Whatever you feel comfortable, you can go ahead and 90% of the task which you can able to search from here, anything related to your financial. In case something which you are not able to search, you can come here and you can able to search here. Okay, either of the ways you can go ahead and search. But what you need to keep in mind is spellings. For example, let's take manage common. Let's search with, just I'm searching with some incorrect spelling. See here, no tasks are associated. For that reason, you need to be very careful with the task name. Okay, as I said initially, if you know that navigation and the task name, 30% of the activities you can able to manage. Okay, it's very simplified compared with EBS. But doing a best practice, doing a thorough practice would be helpful, you know, to become an expert. Okay, on the standard functionality. Of course, other thing, other than standard functionality and all, once you started working on that, you guys, you know, need to enhance your skills and that, that would be generic process, you know, we need to follow. Even for me also, that's applicable. Okay, so well.